only wonder what Gary Lamb has to say. He's been eerily quiet after what I believe was an invasion last month. I, I can't, he looks very focused. I just want to know how in God's green earth did, well, the folks in IWTV, particularly Matt Griffin, make his way into SHW last month? We're about to find out. on Gary's face, now grabbing a mic from Diana. Oh boy.
To whom? To what? Good question. Kick it down, Mario. It's a great show, Hardcore Hell, but right now, we're at Southern Honor. Why are you interrupting me? Like, literally, I gave you your shot. They never officially entered. True. But you survived that and almost to the end. I was impressed. But why? This is not shit show up north, Georgia. Why are you here again? Well, I may have got beaten up by 35 addicts, but I was never eliminated yet forever faithful. are just like those 35 addicts. And Gary, I know you are faithful too. So when I asked you if I could beat up one of those 35 addicts that disrespected me at the Rumble Jack, I know you give me that shot. Well, the problem is this. Yeah, I didn't know you were going to use that term, but you have to shut up a minute. Now you're pissing me off. Because I have given the last 12 years of my life to the pro busted and disgusting. Those you call that. So, GB, we found out a few weeks ago that Cyrus was going to be here, but all we knew was that we were going to find out what's next for Cyrus. Well, we just found out what's next for Cyrus, and his name is Alexander Lev. This, this is true. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. And Lev immediately oh, regretting boy. his decision to call out anybody from the back. Yeah, you know what? If I were Lev, I would have just sat backstage or just bought a ticket here. That would have been much safer than what he has decided to do here now. And we do have an official David Weekly in the ring. This match is officially underway. There's the bell. And again, now Lev going to maybe, I don't know if he's playing mind games or just trying to be smart and stay as far away from Cyrus as possible. I would do my best to stay as far away as possible. Matter of fact, i just start running. I'd run out the front door, and I wouldn't stop. I'd say, you know what, I forfeit. That's it. That's it. You can take the win. I'll keep my life. That's the trade-off here. I think it's a pretty fair one. But now Lev, for the last couple of months, showing up here in SHW, trying to uh, make a name for himself, but you know he's not going to be able to do that against somebody like Cyrus. Well, you know, in the off chance that he gets a couple of blows in on Cyrus, that might be considered a moral victory. But he's got to actually knock Cyrus down or make him submit if he's going to get a win. And I don't see that happening. Well, he's also going to stay in the ring for more than two seconds. Well, then there's that. Oh, boy. Again. Oh! oh a thumb to the eye. I, I don't... Oh, oh, my God. Wow. And he just got rocked. <laughs> literally rocked <laughs> with these left hands oh, from gosh. Cyrus. Oh, Lev gosh. getting destroyed by the Destroyer. Lev, uh... Well, you know, he spent most of the Rumble Jack on his back outside of the ring. Oh, look out. And now Cyrus. Oh! Oh, goodness. That massive one-arm oh, spine buster oh, just 
Finish him off already. Put and, him you away. Know, and you know what's next. He spent a lot of time in Japan. Vader bomb. Mastering Vader bomb. that. Oh, man. And that's got to do it. That's a wrap. Now somebody's got to come in here and straight Alexander Lev off the mat. I agree. I'll tell you what, you know, the, the paramedics around here have been busy. First David Ali earlier tonight, and now somebody's going to have to scrape up the faithful one. You know what I'm wondering? Maybe, just maybe, the faithful Lev is an addict, addict himself. He's addicted to being on the ground. Perhaps addicted to punishment. Who knows? I think so. Yeah. That's a thing. We call him a masochist. Maybe that's who he is. Wow. Because, uh, I yeah. I just face it. He's addicted to punishment. What? Sex, sir. Yeah, Cyrus. And then, uh, kind of a different side of Cyrus as he's high-fiving the fans at ringside and uh, kind of celebrating this victory here tonight. Well, I think it is a celebratory moment for Cyrus. I mean, he came, he saw, he destroyed. It's what he does. But Lev still says he's faithful. How he's walking out is a testament to his faithfulness, I guess. Wow.